This is Jeff Foster for Sonic Fire Pro 5. In this video, I'm going to give you a time condensed version of me working on this project. This is a show bumper and I want to add a soundtrack to it. So hopefully you'll pick something up from this and just be able to kind of absorb through the process here. But at the end, I'll show you the final project in its rendered form with the new soundtrack added to it. But here's just an overview of uh, how this process works. Going to scrub through. Some voiceover. Interview. More voiceover. Interview. And then my closer. So I'm going to render out a small example. Let's make a quick little movie. Now I'll open up Sonic Fire Pro 5 and I'll import that video so I can play my video here in the timeline. This week on DV Tech Week, it's all about compositing. We talk with producer Bob Curtez about doing live compositing on TV. Uh, the infamous hologram from the CNN election night coverage to put that thing on the air for the then I'll come back here, find my points where things come in. EV Tech Week. This this week. Add a marker. Yeah, the infamous. He gets done talking here. And then we take a good look at the Reflect Media LED. All right, let's skip to the end here. All this and all this and more on the next. DV Tech Week. One more marker. Okay, I've got all my markers across here. I go to the spotting bin and I've got all these keyframes selected here. And I want a fast paced uh, piece here. This looks like the most suggested here is 169, so we'll go there. Click on Express Track. Okay. Definitely don't want that. <laughs> so let's come up here to our tempo and sort by that. Now we could just remove the vocal track from that, but that's not what I'm looking for here. This week on DV. Okay, it's a little too intense here. Let's try this one here. This week on DV okay, that one will definitely work. Let's pick some of these. Yeah, try a different variation here. Yeah, that'll make a good intro there. Insert. Okay, let's see what this does for us. This week on DV Tech Week, it's all about composite. Great, and I want to hear my ending. All this and more on the next DV Tech Week. Okay, so I want to change some of the moods in here. Add a mood marker. Markers help. This week. Okay, change that to dialogue. This week on DV Tech Week. It go down and change that to dialogue. Two ninety. So we can pull down some of these instruments. It's a little easier to hear that background. And it customizes the library. Seven. Moments it was there. Okay, we can skip down to the end here. DB Tech Week. Yeah, I want to change that ending just a little bit. I'll come over to the timing control. And let's see, it's gonna start right about there. I'm gonna select this item there. I'm gonna come down to the bin and select a couple different pieces. 
That's got a little more ring to it. That's called Hold On, so I'll select that. All this and more on the next DB Tech Week. Great. Export. Soundtrack video. Okay, then we'll import that. Soundtrack AIF. And we'll put it down here. It's available slot. And then we'll play it back. This week on DV Tech Week, it's all about compositing. We talked with producer Bob Curtez about doing live compositing on TV. Uh, the infamous hologram from the CNN election night coverage. You put that thing on the air. Great. It's a down here. For using this system, as well as some of the pitfalls. Next, we'll be talking with Pam. All this and more on the next DB Tech Week. Okay, everything's really good, except right in here, it gets a little too hot. So I can come back up here and go back to Sonic Fire Pro 5 here, edit original, and that opens everything up right where I had it. So I'll come back in here. This is my problem area. As well as some of the okay, so this, I'm going to bring the transition time down just a little bit. And then we can just nudge this over just a hair to get that guitar to come in a little later. Best practices for using this system, as well as some of the pitfalls. That should take care of that. We'll resave this out. Name it over it itself to replace it. Okay, let's see how we do here. Using this system, as well as some of the pitfalls. Next, we'll be talking with. There we go. So now we'll just render out this whole project <coughs> in full resolution. Okay, and we'll preview the final rendered project. This week on DV Tech Week, it's all about compositing. We talked with producer Bob Curtez about doing live compositing on TV. Uh, the infamous hologram from the CNN election night coverage, you put that thing on the air for the two 90 second moments it was there. Uh, we spent 14 straight days working on it. Much to my surprise, pulled it off. And then we take a good look at the Reflect Media LED front projection system, which allows you to take your green screen with you anywhere. We'll show you the best practices for using this system, as well as some of the pitfalls. Next, we'll be talking with Panavision Senior Vice President John Galt about big budget studio production workflow and just where all that money goes. When you tell a visual effects supervisor, you can basically help him do his composites, you know, and eliminate those hundred people rotoing. <laughs> it doesn't necessarily go down well if he happens to be employed by the facility is going to be doing that. And then we'll take a tour of the live green screen weather map set at KSBY TV to see how it's done. All this and more on the next DV Tech Week. Okay, other than maybe an overall uh, bringing down the volume of the soundtrack uh, entirely, I, I think that was just a really fast workflow in real time including the rendering this probably took you know between oh 30 35 minutes or so i really hope this video gives you a quick overview of how sonic fire pro 5 can create an amazing soundtrack in just a short amount of time for your premiere pro cs5 projects this has been jeff foster for sonic fire pro 5.